Hey, Felix hey, Sater. Tom. Tom Arnold, how are how you, buddy? Are you, Tom? Felix Sater. The Russian-born American citizen and a businessman affiliated with the Trump Organization. He's a guy with a colorful past, which included spending a year in prison for slashing a man's face in a bar fight and a stock fraud conviction involving a mafia link brokerage firm. Are you a cigar smoker? I am. I am. It's been a while. So we have an opportunity to yes. jointly together smoke some Cubans. Oh, I'd be honored. It turns out Felix Sater was also, amazingly, an intelligence operative for the U.S. government. BuzzFeed confirming this week that Sater obtained five of Osama bin Laden's personal phone numbers, helped flip a Taliban source to get information about al-Qaeda training camps, revealed plans for an attempted assassination of George W. Bush and Colin Powell, and went undercover in Cyprus and Istanbul to catch Russian and Ukrainian cyber criminals. Uh, um, why did you let me come out here? Biggest reason I invited you to come out here is because you've got a hell of a sense of humor. Oh. And that goes a long way in my yeah. book. Tell me about your relationship with Donald Trump. Did you do business in Russia with him? I tried to do a Trump Tower Moscow deal yeah. with Donald Trump on three different occasions. Felix, I do not care about the Trump Towers. Uh, by the way, aren't you supposed to get towers after you're the president, you maniac? OK, look, I want to know about the tapes, like the alleged Russian PP tape and the very, very real, not fake, Steele dossier. Do you know Christopher Steele that wrote the dossier? Now, are you following this? Of course. Yeah. You got to believe that guy's legit. No, it's not. OK. What and do you, what do you, what do you think is not legit about it? You know Donald Trump. Yeah. He goes through Purell like uh, most people right. go through water. You no, really but I, believe that, that's he the thing. walked into a room and watched women peeing on each other, even on the bed, you don't think he'd be too scared that maybe no, I think uh, he some would go, spray would hit him? No, and... I think he'd go, like, bad guy, pee on Obama's bed. I can see him doing that. No. Felix doesn't think the Russian PP tape exists, but it's the only reason I can explain why Trump is so nice to Putin. President Putin was extremely strong and powerful in his denial today. Oh my God, get the reach around, huh? But that's not the tape I'm after today. Felix was friends with Donald Trump when Trump owned the Miss Universe pageant from 1996 to 2015. The Miss Universe tapes. Now, I've been trying to find all the behind the scenes footage for many years. Okay, two, year and a half. In, in 2013, when he went to the Miss Universe, Jer walked uh, backstage with the, everybody was naked. Are, were you no, aware? My partner, that... uh, my former partners from Trump Soho were there. Actually, I'm upset. Where was oh, my, my invite? Yeah, yeah. You, well, the, Miss Universe, so once they put a mic on you, you're, wherever you go, wherever you walk, you're being filmed. So you don't think there's any possibility that Donald Trump said something wrong or did yeah. something wrong? No, I don't think so. You know, like a real journalist, after the actual interview, I like to wind down with some guy talk. But of course, Felix didn't think he was on TV still, and things got way, way more interesting. To be honest with you, I am not looking forward to seeing what kind of president Pence is going to be. Oh, he's the worst. Oh, my imagine? God. He he's going to be having prayer book. Yeah, no, but he is the worst. Take a knee and pray. And <laughs> yes, Jesus. but I, I wonder what's going on in that White House with those people. Because they're leaking like crazy. Everybody's like, Trump is, you know, it's his own people that are leaking those shit. What's that? Oh, I, I, I do it for free. I do it. Felix, buddy, your secret about Ivanka being the leaker is safe with me. Take it to the grave.